07836 We're doing a power push from Chester today. Uh, the customer is a British gas contract customer. Uh, combination boiler system, Baxter Geotech. Um, and the, uh, the uh, British gas has re uh, recommended that you get um, a power push done. Um, because the water is fairly black and sludgy. We'll just show you that. It's fairly black and sludgy. We're just going to put a bit of chemical in while we're here actually. Really good chemical. Break down the rust and corrosion. Can't go FX2. Um, so, we've just started the power flushing as you can see. Yeah, the water coming out of there is um, fairly black and, and rusty. We've got micro bore pipe work on the system. 8mm, uh, quite small pipe work but it is copper. And we are getting a good flow through the radiators and uh, through the boiler circuit, etc. Et um, so the job, um, you know, the job's going okay. We've, we've not long started it, but um, it seems everything seems to be going according to plan. Okay, so I'm going to tell you what power flushing is about us, our company, our charges, the areas we cover, our prices, etc. Um, so my name is Barry Ayres of Pro Power Flushing. I'm the actual engineer who carries out the power flush. Um, we've done many hundreds of power flushes, um, you know, since we've been uh, uh, going, uh, which is quite a long time. Um, fully gas safe registered. Um, this is really what we specialise in: power flushing central heating systems. We cover the whole of the northwest UK area, and that's basically we're based in Bramall, Stockport, Cheshire. But we, uh, as, as we said, we're in Chester today. We cover Cheshire, Lancashire, parts of Yorkshire, parts of Derbyshire, parts of Stafford, uh, parts of Nottinghamshire for our power pushing service. We only power push the systems, the BS7593 standard. Um, we actually believe we're one of the best power push companies in the country. The power push does take most of the day to complete and that's because we uh, are here to get results for our customers. We're here to get the system as clean as possible with the best equipment and chemicals and um, if you do use those you're going to save up to 50% um, you know if, you, if, you use, if you're a British gas contract customer you're going to save up to 50% um, of, of their prices, um, we're actually up to 50% cheaper than the major utility companies such as British Gas, Eon, HomeServe, etc. Okay, um, so what is power flushing? Well, um, power flushing is basically a means of flushing through all your central heating system, through your radiator circuit, your boiler, your pipe work, etc. Just getting the inside of the system nice and clean. If you imagine it as an oil change for your central heating system, um, uh, I think you'll get the idea. It's very, very important. It's the best thing you can actually do to your central heating system. Um, all central heating systems have actually got rust and corrosion in them, and uh, if they've never been power flushed, um, they're certainly going to have a fair amount of rust and corrosion in the central heating system. It's of the utmost importance if you are getting a new boiler fitted to get it power flushed, as in the way we're doing now, to BS7593 standard. Um, and um, you know we, we're not just talking about a little bit of mains water and a little bit of chemical through the system um, in all honesty that just doesn't get it clean this is the only way to get a central heating system clean and for that little bit of extra money you're going to spend on a professional power flush um, you, you know it, it just doesn't make sense not to have a professional power flush to be a 7593 standard as we're doing here okay we're very very experienced this is our main um, sort of job um, as we said we're fully gas safe registered which is very very important we can actually get right into the central heating system right into your boiler uh, take components off which some of our power push companies if they're not gas safe registered aren't legally allowed to do so there they are that's very important as well okay today we've actually taken the hoses upstairs over the flat roof uh, in through the bathroom the boiler's actually in the bathroom in a cupboard uh, so we've hooked in through there and um, we don't do things the cheap nasty way we don't just pull a radiator off we want to get right into the main pipes of the system even if that means cutting uh, flow and return pipes to boilers etc uh, you know getting right into the system uh, so we get the best possible flow around the system and back to the power push pump uh, basically it comes back through the pump goes back through this magnet here which is popped up just in the middle we'll show you that later that cut that catches all the rust metal and corrosion that's in the central heating system and um, you know that's what that's what it's about getting all that rust metal and corrosion out of the central heating system um, it can cause absolute mayhem in central heating systems uh, boilers can be overheating cutting out getting blocked up uh, you, you know that, that rust and corrosion wrecks pumps um, you know uh, wrecks diverter valves clogs plate heat exchangers up 
um, you know, pipe work, radiators, etc. Um, so this is the only, only way to get um, a central heating system clean. We'll also tell you, we also do supply and fit boilers. We always power push the systems um, when we're fitting a boiler. So if you are getting a nice competitive quote, if you're on a bit of a budget, and the installer's give, coming around giving you a nice cheap quote, you've got to make sure he's power pushing the system. Because if he's not, if your boiler breaks down in the first year or two, the manufacturer sends their engineers out, they, they may find rust and corrosion in the central heating system and it could actually invalidate the warranty and you may have to fork out for some fairly new expensive parts or even possibly a new boiler. So, you know, this is how important power flushing a central heating system is. Um, we first started power flushing about 12 years ago um, and, and we know from our own uh, experience, uh, we, you know, I actually fitted the boiler in, in my own house uh, a black sea combination boiler, um, quite old boiler now, B rated, but um, in 12 years um, I've spent £11 on my boiler and, and that's because I know it was power flushed uh, to be a 7593 standard, it's a nice clean system, we do add in a bit every couple of years and um, you, you know, um, a, a reliable uh, system, you know, this actually revives your central heating system, we sometimes go to central heating systems that are breaking down um, practically not running at all and after the power push um, you, you know they're running as good as new you know um, so you, you know you sometimes will need a pump and things like that especially on an open vented system not always but um, you know um, like, like we said power pushing is the best thing you can actually do to your central heating system if you can't afford a new boiler and um, you know you, you, your system's playing up giving you problems uh, get it power flushed and more than likely it's going to sort your problem out and um, you're probably going to have a great running system for, for many years to come, even if it's an old system. Okay, so we've got lots to do, we're just going to get back to the job and um, we'll get back to you later then. Hi Barry, how's Pro Power Flushing? Uh, okay, we're just uh, showing where, where we're hooked in with a pump adapter through the boiler. Uh, this basically means the boiler, heat exchanger, etc. is getting flushed uh, right the way through. Okay, the job's just getting done 100% properly. Okay, job's going all right. Uh, we'll just get back to you later. Hi, Barry. Here's Pro Power Flushing. Okay, we've just put the magnet on bypass. We're going to take a look at it, see what rust and corrosion is in the actual central heating system. Oh yeah, wow! Look at that. Can you see that? And there's some fairly big pieces in this uh, central heating system. This is rust, metal, and magnetite that's in your central heating system. If you've not had a power flush, this is what is in your central heating system. This is what. Uh, destroys pumps, uh, blocks valves up, um, plate heat exchanges, radiators, uh, microball pipe up, etc. and generally causes mayhem in your central heating system. And this is what power flushing is all about. It's about getting all this rust and corrosion out of your central heating system. Okay, the job's going alright, um, we're just going to get on with it and uh, we'll get back to you later. Okay. Hey Barry, here's Pro Power Flushing. Okay, just back to this job. Um, you, you may be wondering how we know if the water's uh, getting clean enough, um, well what we do is we take the pH and TDS levels of the tap water and uh, we compare them to the system water and our objective is, is to try and get the system water as uh, near possible as tap water as possible before we actually have the centre max 100. Uh, we also use a turbidity uh, jug which basically means um, that we can see the, um, there's a couple of little black rings, if we can see that through the actual water, um, that's how we, uh, we can also test the water for contamination and um, we can take the pH and TDS levels. We know the water around Chester is a little bit um, corrosive to be honest, um, the pH isn't so high, um, the TDS is quite high, um, we've actually been here before and it does actually cause water. Um, it does, does actually cause uh, problems in, in the boilers, uh, lime scale, etc. Okay, uh, the job's going all right, and um, we're just going to get on with it, and uh, we'll get back to you later. Bye. Okay, Barry Ayers, uh, Pro Power Flushing, just back to this Power Flushing Chester. Uh, we're starting to rinse the system out, uh, the job is going uh, really well, getting a great flow around the system. Uh, the water is starting to come clearer now as we're rinsing and um, obviously once the pH and CDS levels are right uh, we will be adding the inhibitor and putting uh, the central heating system back together. Uh, we'll talk a little bit more about price um, obviously um, we are um, when we power flush your system you've got us for most of the day 
Um, we do put the time in, you will not get a better power flush anywhere in the country. So if you have, uh, say, got a British gas contract or Eon, a home turf contract, and you realistically want to save uh, £300 or more, um, y y you know, just give me a call. Um, you will not get a better job. It's all okay with your service provider, whether it be British Gas, Eon, Home Serve, etc. Um, we take our PH, TDS readings. Uh, you will get a certificate upon completion at a power flush. Um, so you you're basically going to get the best possible power flush you can get and it's going to be fully certificated um, also. Um, we don't do cheap, cheap power flushes. We don't do £200 power flushes. Um, you've got us all day. Um, we, we, we believe we give excellent value for money. Um, and um, as we said, you know, you, you will save some money, uh, a lot of money in fact, if you've got a British gas contract here on a home sub contract. Okay? So uh, we're just going to get on with it and uh, we'll get back to you later on. Thanks. Okay, barriers, profile pushing okay, the water's nice and clear now. We've taken the PA to TBS readings. We're going to add the inhibitor Sentinel X100 um, into the system and let it circulate around the system for about 10 minutes. We're breaking the seal here. You see that? And pour it into the central heating system. Okay, this will circulate around the central heating system for about 10 minutes, get it into all the nooks and crannies, and um, this is a sealed central heating system and we recommend uh, this Sentinel X100 be added uh, every two years. Uh, basically it prevents uh, corrosion and large scale uh, further build up in the central heating system. Okay, uh, we'll just get back to you later, thanks. Okay, uh, we've added the Sentinel and uh, we're just going to show you this. What that Sentinel has actually done is neutralised the uh, system water uh, in the central heating system. So basically, it's got a pH level of 7, uh, which means uh, it's neutral. Before it had a pH of uh, just over 5, um, I think it was 5.5 or 5.6, which meant it was more acidic. Uh, and that's, you know, that's what causes all the problems, basically in the central heating system okay so um, the job's going really good so uh, we'll just uh, get on with it and we'll get back to you later okay. we've also got the powerful dog keeping us company today this is the customer's dog uh he's just uh, being nosy uh well, wants to see that i'm doing the job right okay uh, we'll get back to you later thank you okay that's power flush done now the radiator is heating up nice um while it's nice and quiet we're just going to put the cover back on um, so the job's a complete success. If you want any power flushing done, this is in Chester today. Just give me a call on telephone number 07836 353 985 or contact us through our website. Okay, thank you.